Okay, I'm going to do a quick review of this tea right here from Nepali Tea Traders, Pakara Classic. It's a green tea. You can see what it looks like inside, and I poured some of the leaves out for you guys right here. You can see they're like a dark green, black color rolled up. Look pretty standard for green tea leaves. Um, they smell really good. One thing I like about Nepali Tea Traders teas is on the back of their teas, they could give you specific directions on how to brew them um, which most teas come with but they'll usually say like get the water a certain temperature and if you don't have an electric tea kettle or like a thermometer that you're keeping track of the temperature of the tea it can be a little bit hard to guess and so they just say okay get it to a rolling boil for this particular one cool it for three minutes and then steep for two to three minutes so I really like that it makes it easy um, to use and so I've already boiled my water, I've already let it cool, and then for this um, review I'm using this type of um, tea infuser where you can see in here the leaves are. I'll pour the hot water in, put the lid on, let it sit, and then pour it into these cups. Okay, so I poured the water in, we'll put the lid on, and we'll let it sit for two to three minutes. Okay, it's been sitting for three minutes. We'll pour it out. So you can see this first pouring is a little bit lighter. Just because in this style of brewing, the leaves are on the bottom. So like the darker color is on the bottom. So when I'm brewing it like this, I usually like to pour this one out just a little bit, not even that much, and then pour my glass and it'll be a little bit darker color like that. Okay, so I just took a drink and it tastes super good. It's fresh and it's light, but like other green teas I've had tend to be bitter or astringent. This is not. It's just really smooth. And when you get this, when you smell it, it smells like a green, fresh smell. And that is also in the flavor and taste of it. Um, it's definitely easy to drink. And it's just like light. But it has a deep flavor, so it's enjoyable to drink. Um, I have had this now a few times and on here it says that you can brew it yeah maybe re-steeped once for added enjoyment but I've actually steeped it four times the same leaf so that means after I'm done drinking these I would pour more water in here start the process over let it sit for three minutes pour out another cup and you could repeat that process and so usually it's about one teaspoon of leaves so every eight ounces of water um, and you can, you know, play with that more or less depending on, like, how strong you like your tea. But I've been able to brew these four times, and it's been super good. So, if you're looking to try a new tea, I highly recommend this one from Nepali Tea Traders. And if you are wondering about the name, that is a town in Nepal. So, pretty much all of their names are either like mountains there or um, towns or just different things that have to do um, with the country of Nepal. So check them out, nepaliteatraders.com, and you can use my code when you check out Everest15. I'll post it in the comments and you'll get 15% off. But yeah, I definitely recommend this tea if you're into green teas. It's super good.